Hi, Nando here from Carbon Zero. We're at the end of September and the tomatoes are at the end of their growing season. And I wanted to make a video to show you uh, the progress of the trial. Uh, we're looking at the control group of uh, one of the varieties that has been grown this year. And I want to show you two things. One is the height of the tomatoes. Um, I've taken height measurements of all the tomatoes uh, a day or two ago. And also the number of, of fruits that, that remain on the vines. I think I may do a, a census count as I did earlier in the season on the remaining tomatoes. I think there are about 14 plants here. <clears throat> And I'll just walk down the row so that you can see them. Uh, note the number of tomatoes, their size, that are on the vines. Uh, and get a sense of their height as well. So I'll, I'll back out of here. <clears throat> and... This is, again, the control group of tomatoes that did not receive wood vinegar treatments. And let's take a walk over here and take a look at the, at the treatment group. <clears throat> and again, I want you to note the number of tomatoes that are on the vines and the height. The bars from which they're, they're suspended are more or less the same. And in the, the treatment group, you'll see that there are plentiful bunches of, of fruit that are still on the, on the vines and that they are remarkably higher and that the number of fruit that's present on the vines is definitely greater than in the control group. I'll take a walk down the entire row so that you can see it. I don't know if these tomatoes will fully ripen on the vine. It's definitely the end of the season. Here's another row. These were also treated, and you can see, again, the height of the tomatoes and the number of fruits that are still present on the, on the vines. Without any statistical analysis, I'd say that the, dif the difference is... Uh, quite significant. So that's what I wanted to show you today regarding the tomatoes. Um, thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video. Bye for now.